what is going on you guys make it wayne back and today we do have a new pickup for the squad and that is going to be 89 overall kenny lofton this card is an absolute beast i know he's only an 89 but i used him in battle royale and i had to finish the indians collection right away that is how you get this card that's not kenny lofton but looking at his stats 86 contact versus right 74 contact versus left 91 vision 86 clutch 76 bunning 95 fielding he robs home runs all the time i think i've already robbed two home runs with him in only six games that i've had him i don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing because i'm giving up bombs but we get a look at his speed and it is 93 he beats out balls in the infield all the time he's an absolute beast and i can't wait to show you guys this card if you guys are enjoying the Diamond Dynasty gameplays and want to see another one as soon as possible, even tomorrow, make sure to smash that like button. Let's get into it. Taking a look at my opponent's lineup, he has Christian Yelich, Ian Kinsler, Kyle Seeger, Chris Bryant, Ben Zobris, Will Myers, George Springer, Chris Archer on the mound, and he also has Jonathan Lucroy. I've got Noah Syndergaard today, and I'm excited to use Lofton in the two-hole. Switching up ballparks in this gameplay, going with Nationals Park. Let's see what we are going to get from Noah Syndergaard today. We have been struggling, but I expect him to turn that around because he's not like he's not a good pitcher. I've just been struggling with him, so we do have an 0-2 count to start it off. So let's go with the curveball down in the dirt. See if we can get a swing and miss here. Curveball, and he's out of here. Already one down in the inning. Ian Kinsler up to the plate going with the fastball, and we are going to end up breaking his bat for strike one. So let's go with the sinker down in the zone. See what he is able to do with it. Most likely going to be a ground ball if he does make contact with. That's a line drive, and I'm diving with Lofton. Not a good idea. That ball is going to get passed all the way to the wall. Let's throw him out. Edmonds all the way to third base, and he's going to be safe. That right there is the reason why I never dive in. Oh, my goodness. We give up a tank on the next pitch. Runner on second base, one out in the inning. Noah Syndergaard already struggling in this one as that one is hit high. Very deep into the outfield, but that is going to be a catchable ball for Lofton. Two outs, runner on third. Two outs in the inning. Will Myers up to the plate, and let's see if we can get out of this inning without any more damage done. We could use a strikeout here as he is going to foul that one off, so please throw the fastball where I want it, and he will be unable to hit it. And that's not where I wanted it. And just like every single time, I keep hoping every time it's going to get better. But he is struggling with his control. We are going to get the strikeout. Three outs. Let's get some runs. You guys getting your first look at Kenny Lofton. Let's see what he is going to be able to do. That's a change up down in the zone. And that is going to be a foul ball. We were early on it. So we've got to wait back. Keep in front of the ball. That's up in the zone. We are making some contact. That one is pretty deep, but he is going to make the grab. Two outs in the inning. Runner on third base, and we're not trying to give up this run, so we need to pick our spots around the zone. Try and get him to swing and miss just like that. Four strike one, so let's go with a sinker down in the zone, and he's hitting that one, but that's an easy play for Jim Edmonds. Three outs. Jim Edmonds up to the plate, my favorite center fielder in this game. Let's see what he's talking about. Not able to get anything going in the first inning. We need to start watching pitches like that as that is going to be a ball. 1-0 count. Let's see what he's going to bring to us, and that's a fastball, and I'm right on that. Jim Edmonds is a beast. Prince Fielder up to the plate, finally getting his average over 200 as he does go with the changeup. We are going to get good timing, but that was really low in the zone, so let's see what he's going to bring to us, and that's a fastball. I probably should have laid off it, but we are going to get strike two, so just like that, we're in an 0-2 count, and that was a good pitch to hit. But we are going to foul it off. We do have Jim Edmonds on first base. Let's see if we can drive a ball somewhere. Get this man around the bases. And we're watching that pitch. So we're putting together a good at bat here. One, two count. Give me a pitch to hit. Let's go, Prince Fielder. I know you got it in you. Let's see what we've got. That's a changeup down in the zone. And it's going to be off the pitcher. Tough play. And he's not going to get it. That's going to be an error down the line. And we are going to have first and second. No outs. 0-2 count on Jonathan Lucroy. Runners on first and second. Let's see if he can do something to get these runs in. And that's not going to work. But it does get by the catcher. We might have a chance. 
Uh, Will Myers up to the plate, top of the fourth inning, one out. Let's see what we can get, as that's going to be a circle change for a strike. He was early on it, so he was definitely looking for a fastball. So let's not give him one here either, as he is going to watch that pitch go by. So let's go with the sinker down in the zone. Please keep it down, Syndergaard. And we will get a swing, and he got it up, but Kenny Lofton's going to be there with his great defense. I have no idea who he has at shortstop, but that was a great play. I think it's Corey C but I'm not sure as Prince Fielder is up to the plate and I've got to put better at bats together guys you know I get too impatient when I am up at the plate is that's a fastball I am right on that that is hit very high very deep and that's just a fly out Jose Bautista up to the plate who's going to be the difference maker today and get us these runs I just keep swinging at pitches like that I've got to be more disciplined at the plate or we're just going to keep striking out. So let's see what he is going to bring to us here. And that's a change up down in the zone. So he's picking around the zone. Not really going in the zone. So like I said, I've got to be more patient. What are we getting here? As that's going to be a slider for a ball. We've got this, man. We definitely can score runs with the lineup. We get hits all the time. But let's see. What are we going to get here? And that's a good pitch to hit. That one is driven in the gap. And see you later, Jose Bautista. This man is absolutely on fire. We got a run back for Noah Syndergaard. So we need him to send us back into the dugout without any more of a deficit. As we are going to get a ground ball. Easy play. Christian Yelich up to the plate. He's been quiet at the leadoff spot. He is 0 for 2 so far far let's make it 0 for 3 Jonathan Lucroy up to the plate let's see what he's gonna do I could use him on base so I could get a sacrifice bunt with Noah Syndergaard but that's not gonna do a job Noah Syndergaard back onto the mound going into his sixth inning of work let's see if we can keep going through this lineup not trying to give up any more runs because right now we are struggling to score them. We are still down by one. We're going with the changeup. And oh, I thought he was going to make that play. Runner on first base trying to keep the ball down in the zone. So we can get a ground ball and turn a double play. Not a lot of speed at the plate or on the bases. Let's turn this double play. There's one going for two. That's what I'm talking about. Haven't gone with the curveball in a while. So let's go with it here. Try and get a swing and a miss. And that's exactly what we are going to get. He was looking for the fastball there. So let's give it to him here get it in on his hand so he can't do anything with it that's exactly where i wanted it so we do have an o2 count please throw the change up in the dirt and we will get out of this inning throw the change up in the dirt and he is able to hold back good job by him but now it's time to go to the put away pitch the 12-6 curveball see you later the time is now to get these run backs kenny lofton quiet in this game so far oh for two with two flyouts but like i said We've got to get the ball on the ground and use his speed to our advantage. I see a ton of gaps out there. Let's see if we can hit it there. And there we go. That's going to be our first hit. No, a line out. Two outs in the inning. Jim Edmonds up to the plate. Did ground out in his last at bat. Let's see what we can get here as we are going to foul off the changeup. We are going to be late on it. So let's see what we are going to get here. I'm guessing it's going to be a fastball. Let's see if we do get a fastball. That's exactly what we get in Jim Edmonds. Another multiple hit game. Prince Fielder up to the plate. Let's see if we can get anything going with him as he is going to paint a changeup. And just like that, we're down in the count. One, two. Come on, man. Let's get something going. Let's get something going. He does throw that pitch, and that is going to be a single down the line. That's what I'm talking about. The man who got the first run on the board last to bat is back up to bat, trying to get another one here, and he's throwing a slider in the dirt. I got a little bit eager there. It is 0-1, so let's see what he's going to bring to us here. Come on, man. I've got to put together better at bats than this. That is just absolutely inexcusable, as that's going to be a ball. Bring me a pitch to hit. Come on, man. Give me something I can drive. Let's see what we got. Jose Bautista up to the plate. Ball two. I'm getting more patient, man. Come on. Bring me a pitch to hit. I know you don't want to, but I dare you to. I dare you to bring me a pitch to hit. And we are going to roll over on that one. Dang it. 1-1 one, one count. Noah Syndergaard trying to put this last batter away to get a good ending on his start. And that's exactly what he's going to do. Let's get some runs. What the...
Okay, so I guess Prince Fielder dropped that last ball in foul territory, so we do have a 1-2 count. I'll take that. Carlos Correa up to bat. He is going to be coming in at shortstop in this inning. Let's see if he can provide the spark in this one we need. Still down by a run in the bottom of the seventh inning. We are going to be going into the bullpen next inning. So let's see if we can get something here. And that was a slider to drive, but I am going to be early on it, so it is a 1-2 count. Two outs in the inning. Come on, Carlos. Make some contact. Great pitch. Aroldis Chapman now on to the mound in the eighth inning. I know this isn't his usual role, but we need him to take this role and get some outs. One out in the inning. Jonathan Lukoy up to the plate for him. Going with a changeup. He's making some contact, but he's hitting to the MVP. Easy play. Two pitches, two outs. Let's see if we can get three pitches, three outs. But he is going to swing and miss at that pitch four strike one so let's see what we can here going with some off speed haven't thrown it yet let's see what we can get and he is going to foul that one off four strike two so now it's time to put him away we've got a 100 mile per hour fastball why not use it at his eyes going with it and he is going to watch it good job by him but i bet you he swings at this pitch right here going with the changeup down low in the zone and he's making some contact easy play three outs we need a run Bringing in a pinch hitter, Diamond Anthony Rizzo. Let's see what he can do. And if he can do anything against Carter Caps, we are down to our final out. Let's see if he gives us anything to hit. And that's going to be a ball I was able to hold off. Come on, man. We can't go down like this. We've got to get something going. And if that's the last out, that is absolutely terrible. And yeah, that is going to be the last out. We end up losing 2-1, to one, not able to get anything going at all on offense. It's not like Chris Archer was just a stud pitcher. I mean, he is good in real life, but I was just struggling, man. I got a ton of hits in this game. I think I got six, but we were just not able to produce with them at all. He did have a good rating, but I'm not trying to make excuses. We definitely had a lot of chances to get something done. Can we get that Gio Gonzalez? No, we can't get the Gio Gonzalez. We're going to end up getting as the servers are loading. Come on, man. Show me what I got. Another minor league stadium. Thank you so much. I wanted that one. But that's going to be it for this video, guys. If you are enjoying the gameplays. Oh, wait. Kenny Lofton didn't have a very good day. He missed that diving catch. But I'm telling you guys, in gameplays to come, he's going to be really good for my team. And he's going to get a ton of hits. Just not a very good debut. But I promise you guys, he's going to be a beast. But if you guys are enjoying these gameplays and want to see another one as soon as possible, make sure to smash that like button. But that's going to be it for this video, guys. I want to thank you for watching. Make sure to leave a like on it if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new to my channel for more MLB The Show 16 Diamond Dynasty gameplays. Go follow me on Twitter twitch and instagram the links are all in the description now below and until next time guys have a good one